Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to another lore of League of Legends. I gotta say that without too much of an introduction, I present to you the lore of Zillion, the Chrono Keeper. Enjoy. The great city of Ertistan, located west of Shurma Desert, used to be a great and prosperous utopia where every man could find a place for himself. Almost everyone used to be happy with their positions. The citizens of Ertistan didn't have to worry about material wealth. But this all changed with the Rune Wars. For unknown reasons, this part of the continent had been damaged more than any other part of Valoran. The once fair and mighty city of Ertistan had been reduced to nothing more than mud and clay. The city had perished, and with it, most of its citizens. But there was one who survived, a sorcerer named Zillion, who was obsessed with time and affecting it through the use of magical spells. As it was the only real fitting place for him, he had chosen the city's clock tower as his residence. As the havoc of the Rune Wars neared his home, Zillion tried experimenting with temporal magic to divine all possible futures. Searching through all possible timelines, the sorcerer hoped to find the one where Ertistan would survive unharmed. He was, however, stuck beyond time, in a place where perception could be deceiving. When Zillion had still been trapped in his contemplative stasis, the city had been set upon. A group of dark, powerful summoner knights had raided the city. They destroyed the city's protective barriers, allowing more powerful spells to aid the destruction of Erdistan in any possible way. The only place that was left unharmed was the clock tower, where Zillion had still been trapped. The summoner knights wanted to avoid drawing the sorcerer's attention, but also wanted to punish the mage for his foolish oversight. When he finally returned to the world, he was given little time to grieve for his loss. He'd been affected by a disease unknown to the mage or anyone else on the continent, chronodysplasia. This mystical disease caused Zillion to exist between timelines, existing in numerous places at the same time, and as such, he could not die. His mind often drifted through time, however, and without his control, often wandered into his past and even sometimes, the future, but despite that knowledge, he's unable to affect the events in any way. Only powerful summoning magic used by the League summoners enabled Zillion to tie his body and mind together for short periods of time. Upon this discovery, Zillion joined the League, serving summoners not only as a champion, but also an advisor, often discussing the outcomes of certain decisions that the summoners intended to make. Whilst earning the respect of the summoners, this had never been his goal. All Zillion wishes to achieve is finding a cure for chronodysplasia, and hopes that the summoner's magic, if used in the right way, could one day stop his mind from wandering on its own. But so far, the research has been no use. Once he himself is cured, he endeavours to complete another goal he has had since the attack on his home. To find a way to affect the flow of time, and find a way to save his people. And that's it for this one ladies and gentlemen, I hope you enjoyed the video and if you did please do leave a like down below and share the video around. Don't forget the annotation at the top of the video will take you to the playlist, so if you've missed any champions thus far, that's the place to click. Thanks for watching everyone, and as always, I'll see you next time.